you know, some of my friends, they laugh. They said, oh, you know, it's an honor to be put on like a government watch list. Believe me, it's not. It's really, it's really frightening. And it just causes, you know, mistrust. And when you do that to a community leader, it, it, it really kind of terrorizes all the people in the community because, you know, you're trying to encourage them to be politically active, to stand up for their rights, to, you know, stand up against discrimination. And then you yourself are, are targeted and now you're involved in this, this lawsuit. So it's really an effective way to frighten the community. The government has no business uh, knowing you uh, that that closely unless you're doing something wrong unless you're doing something illegal you're harming people otherwise the government really needs to you know t close its eyes and and look the other way it, it should not be you know the government should not be the peeping Tom um, you know in the in the name of national security everybody has uh, things that they want to keep private uh, you know, that's who we are as a people, that the inside of our minds, um, our personalities, our, our um, how should I say, our, you know, the things that we enjoy, our freedoms, those things are intensely personal and intensely private.